my name is Grace. Today I'm going to the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Dreams Come True. Joseph Raised to Power. Let's read. Joseph served Portugal well, but Portugal's wife wanted Joseph to sin against God. Joseph refused, so she lied about him. Portugal believed her, and Joseph was thrown into prison. So Joseph served Portugal well, but his wife didn't. He, she wanted Joseph to sin against God. In prison, Joseph met two of her first servant, servants. They each had a dream, and God showed Joseph their meaning. Joseph's explanation came true. The copper was released, and the baker was hanged. So in prison, Joseph met two of her first servants. They were copper and baker and copper was they had at each dream and joseph saw what god god showed the meaning of the dream and joseph's explanation came true the copper was released and the baker was happy Two years later, Paro had two troubling dreams. The copper remembered what Joseph has done for him and told Paro. So Paro sent for Joseph and told him his dream. So like later, it came true. So copper was released and copper has like, forget Joseph for a long time. And two years later, Paro had a troubling dreams. So that time, Kapir has sought for Joseph, and the Kapir told Paro that Joseph can explain the dream. So Paro sent Joseph and tell the dream. God showed the meaning of power stream. For seven years, a lot of food will grow, said Joseph. So store up food because seven years of famine will follow. So God showed the dream of meaning of the dreams. And Joseph explained that. Seven years, there will be a good year. There will be lots of good growth. growth and they have to store food because also seven famine will follow. Question. God helped Joseph understand the meaning of the dreams. True. With God's help, Joseph has told the meaning of the dream to Paro. Paro was ex impressed by Joseph's wisdom, so he put 
Joseph in charge of storing up all the food. Apart from Paro, no one in Egypt was powerful than Joseph. So Paro was so pleased so with his wisdom. God has helped Joseph because God is with Joseph. So he put Joseph in charge of storing up all the food. No one was powerful that except Paro. <sighs> Joseph's brother went to Egypt to buy food. They borrowed Joseph before Joseph because of Joseph, but did not recognize them. When he saw that they had changed, he told them who he was. So Joseph's brother went to the went to Egypt to buy food because they didn't have any food to eat in their home. So they bowed before Joseph, but they didn't recognize him. So Joseph tested his brother that he dare change or not change. Joseph, there, there is, was 12 brothers, but now there's 11 because Joseph is in Egypt. So they said, bring your youngest son, youngest brother. But they said, uh, and when they brought Benjamin, the youngest son, Joseph was like giving them good foods, but they didn't, they was not jealous. So he knew that they were changed. So when they knew they were changed, they Joseph told who he was. Question: What did Paro put Joseph in charge of? Number one, the guards. Number two, caramel. Number three, the food. Number three was the correct answer. The brothers were terrified. You mean to harm me, Joseph said, but God used that for good. Bring all your family of our family to Egypt. We will have plenty to eat. So Joseph were terrified. Uh, the, the brothers were terrified because they had tried to kill him. But Joseph said, "But God used that for good. Bring all our family." Joseph's brother mean to harm him, but God brought good out of it. True. Yes, today we read the Bible story. Did you enjoy the next time? We'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye.